yo, man, that's your boy Lakitu back at it with another fucking banger, nigga. You know how the fuck I'm coming, man. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think about the video, man. And let's get straight to the business. You heard me? As you can see, man, the one week I was up 800. Past month, I was up 700 on a down market, too. On a fucking red market, too, bro. I was really, like, my account was struggling. That's why I had to sell my ZOM and shit like that. You heard me? How to capitalize on my option game. You know, I'm strong with that shit. And yeah, man. I'm about to show you how to re-support and resistance soon. But look, man. I hope y'all took advantage on the big dip that SP500 had when this whole opened up. When this whole opened up at 380. And then that bitch started crashing down. You know, and then curled up real quick to the top. You heard me? To the top. I hope y'all got in some, you know, some easy money plays, man. Like, let's look at a little key to some run type of shit. I hope y'all got in that torch light. I made a video about that hoe. Matter, matter of fact, man, let's go back to that hoe. But look, I made a video about that hoe when it was 158. So we already been hitting the whole run on that bitch. Oh, God, we already hit that home run. That hoe went to like f almost $4 back in the grip. Like two weeks ago when the market was green. You heard me? You know what I'm saying? I caught this hole when it was like 150-ish. Yeah, man. I hope y'all took advantage of that shit, man. As you can see, it started off at 217. And then that bitch just started crashing down. And so whole market started crash down because of the SP500. You know what I'm saying? That shit just... And then it took off. I hope y'all took advantage. You see this, right? 185 back to the top, nigga. Just like that. So if you would have bought your positions, you would have got your position established on the dip. Nigga, you would have been up crazy right now. Especially with all the stimulus news coming out, man. Y'all would have got a 1K shares on that bit. Make a quick hundo. You know what I'm saying? I hope y'all loaded on, on this one too. We had an amazing dip. To lowest as 126. See what I'm saying? You would have got your 100 shares of this one too. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of a lot of stocks, man, that you, you could have capitalized. Extremely capitalized. Extreme, stream, stream. And a good one I was looking into, it was um what is it at? Right here. IDX. You know, I have 15 contracts with this hoe. As you can see, man, IDX had a pretty beat down day, man. It went down to every other stock. And it crashed to 242. That's an amazing buying zone. You'll barely see that number ever again. You know what I'm saying? And then that whole started going slowly up with a lot of momentum. And I have I have like 11 contracts for the in the money. So basically 11 contracts equals to um I would say like 1.1k shares. I want to write, hold it until expiration March 19. So as you can see, man, last week on IDX it was to 378. And the market was down too. So imagine that. And the market was down 378. And then it started crashing as the market started to crash even harder. And last month that hole went to like 534. You heard? That hole really had some buying pressure in that hole. And then, yeah. Let's go back to the three months. See, as you can see, three months ago, shit was looking decent. You would easily double up your money, man. If you would, you got your position established, you would easily. That's why I need to see you out of the game. How to read the SP500 and the support on where a stock is going to go. Either it's going to reach the second support or the first support. So you can get a, a good entry. And don't put all your money into one stock and an entry. Because you don't know if the market's going to keep still dropping harder than ever. And then, let's, for example, you add 100 shares to this bitch. And if it keeps dropping, you add another 100 shares to this bitch. Average cost down. And then you're good after that. Once that hole go up, you know what I'm saying? Simple as that, man. Let's go. So you can see it's a lot of penny stocks, man. You could have took advantage of this one. Orbital Energy, man. This is an amazing penny stock. A runner. Shit dip right here. Boom. Boom. Start to take off, nigga. What? I would have easily doubled your money right here. If you would have got your 125 shares, like I recommend. Bio. Bio had a, a, a worst day yesterday. But it easily got your 1,000 shares. Run that bitch up back. Tellurian. Energy stock. I love this shit. I love this stock. I was thinking about dipping, buying a dip on this shit, but I wasn't. It wasn't in my mind though. You know what I'm saying? At this price right here, 204, man. This is an amazing price right here. This is how you know 
this is how you know there's a strong support right here. As you can see, it tried to break, bounced up, tried to break, took off. Nigga, what? Nigga was not playing. Tolorian, let's look at the one week on Tolorian 301, looking lovely. The one month, looking super bullish, 380. The three months, this shit took off. And it's a, it's a, it's a 987.64 million cap. Last time I saw the stock, like a month ago, this shit was a 1 billion. It's probably because the market is down. It probably took it down a little bit. The 52 week high is 48. I mean, $4.38. So, yeah, man. I got to capitalize. Sundown. Sundown had a bad day, too. Niggas would run it up. Touched a strong ass support that it could not break. 93 cents. Nigga, last night he took an L and tonight I bounced back. Basically, what that nigga said. You know what I'm saying? Ring energy. This hole never goes really down that much. I guess it's really that strong. You know, and I took advantage of this PTN, Palantir Technology, man. Kind of like this stock. I wish I would have got it at 60, man. But I got it at 66 cents, though. Still opportunity up $7. And yeah, man, y'all got to learn how to capitalize in Chris Sainz plays. Like, look, I'm about to see, I'm about to show you. Hylion, man, y'all should have capitalized on Hylion. Hylion was at 1140, 1131, man. Y'all should have been cap. It went, no, it went to as low as 1117. And it bounced back, you know what I'm saying? So if you would have got your 125 shares, you would have capitalized. You know what I'm saying? Like. Such as Neo 2. Neo went as low as 3191. If you would have got an option call on Neo, you would have been up crazy. Crazy, crazy amount of money, man. No cap. Shit like that. And clean energy. I was thinking of starting a play for y'all on this one. I got to get more information about this one. So if we could ride the wave back to like 20 ish. You know what I'm saying? Right away back to 20. The 52 week high is 1979. So we could definitely go ride the bit back to 20, especially with Biden. And fuel so energy, we could ride this whole back to 22. You know what I'm saying? I got I had um this whole went as low as 1107. And you could already capitalize on that shit. You know how we coming though. 52 week high is 29. So this is definitely going back up. Especially now that the stimulus is getting passed and shit like that. But yeah, man. It's your boy Lakita, man. I just got to let y'all know how to capitalize because every stock was down. You know what I'm saying? As soon as this goes down, the SP500, you see you see the pattern? This is what controls the market, basically. Drops down, curls up. Every stock in their moms has the same pattern as the SP500. And the reason I'm saying this is, look, let's look at Tesla. The big dog. See, same pattern. Same pattern. That's why I look at the SP500 before I buy. I never buy high. I always buy low. Remember that, dog. Let's look at Amazon. Big dog. Same pattern. See? Let's look at Microsoft. Same pattern. Down. Microsoft is holding strong off that support right there, man. That nigga was not letting it happen. That nigga bounced the fuck up. Nigga said, nah, hold up took off to Mars type of shit you me? And yeah basically that's how to teach you man hopefully y'all got some knowledge of this video cause I definitely I definitely went into hustle as you can see man I definitely bought this this stock 24, 22 shares at 60 cents and it dipped at 58 but I still capitalized you know what I'm saying I capitalized that's all that matters man but yeah I'm off this man make sure you like comment subscribe Shit, bro, the key to them all day, ho.